What is up guys, Delboy here. So, a rather interesting European heavyweight title fight could be taking place February next year between Ajit Kabayel and Otto Walin. Otto Walin was the mandatory challenger for the European title. Purse bids were called, but it looks like both parties have reached an agreement and it looks like the fight will take place in February next year in Germany. Not official yet, no official date, but it is looking very likely. And I have to say, I do really like this fight. It would be a meaningful fight for the European heavyweight title. Both guys are undefeated. Both guys are still quite young for heavyweights. You know, Caballo is 26 and Otto Walin is 27. Um, both guys are looking to get to that next level in the heavyweight division. There really is a lot on the line in this fight. I think if it happened, it would be a very hard fight to call. Both guys are quite technical for heavyweights. We saw Caballel box a really crafty fight against Chizora. He outboxed Chizora for the most part. Um, he proved his skills that night. Also, Caballel, you know, he's beaten guys like... Christian Lewandowski, who was an undefeated prospect at the time. He beat Herve Habu, who is a Belgian sort of um, European level fighter. In these fights, Caballel proved he could box a bit, you know, he could move. Um, quite well schooled, a good understanding of keeping distance. Caballel is a good solid boxer, and it has been a shame he's not really managed to push on from that Chisora win, because... He beat Chisora quite comfortably, in my opinion, and Chisora went on to be the co-main event on a pay-per-view show, and then he went on to, well, as we know, he's headlining a pay-per-view against Dillian White. So, you know, it goes to show how boxing works. Unfortunately, Caballel hasn't really had the opportunities since that fight, but this fight would be an opportunity, so I hope he gets it. Um, Otto Walin. Again, much like Caballel, a good boxer, a good technician in terms of heavyweight standards. Unlike Caballel, um, Walin is a southpaw, so he brings that element as well. Uh, Otto Walin coming off the biggest win of his career when he beat fellow countryman Adrian Granat. That was a big fight in Sweden and Otto Walin um, outboxed him. In that fight, he displayed good skills and an ability to handle pressure moments because although it might not mean much to us, Walin versus Granat was a big fight in Sweden. It got quite a bit of attention. There was a rivalry there and Otto Walin, you know, he maintained his composure and he boxed a really good fight. So in that fight he showed he had something about him. Otto Walin in his career has also beaten journeymen such as Rafael Zambano Love. Um, Beato Costa Jr., you know, guys like that. He's always displayed um, fairly solid skills, good movement. Not the biggest puncher, neither is Caballel, but like I said, a solid technician from that southpaw stance. And while in versus Caballel should be a really competitive fight, I think it is a fight that could go either way. Being the fight is looking likely to be in Germany, and promoted by Caballel's backers by the looks of it. I might just give Caballel the edge, to be quite honest. Not only that, Caballel has, in my opinion, fought a higher level of competition. I think Chizora, despite him being past his best, in my opinion, is still better than anybody Otto Wallen has fought so far. So if a fight happens, I would give a edge to Ajit Caballel. I also think probably he's a bigger puncher as well. But yeah, really good fight. I like this fight because it's two young undefeated guys going at it. Either one of these guys could have fought like fringe level heavyweights who have been about, you know, guys like Marius Wack or um, Ustinov, Spielker, you know, guys like that. Guys who are still somewhat credible, but guys who are there to be beat. They could have easily fought guys like that, but... You know, if they fight each other, that's a really good look and it's a fight I would get behind. So share your thoughts below on this potential fight. How would you see it playing out? Peace.